Hello friends, welcome, welcome to this channel Chemistry Crafters with Bono and I am Arun Kumar. Today we will discuss how to prepare phenyl compound or phenyl concentrate. With 1 liter of phenyl compound, we can mix 19 liters of water and we can prepare 20 liters of white phenyl or colored phenyl or scented phenyl or thick phenyl. Anything is possible. So we need to know how to prepare phenyl concentrate. For phenyl concentrate, there are two or three methods are available. This is one standard method, but not a cheaper method. Today, we are going to prepare phenyl compound by using these three materials. Number one, oleic acid. Number two, soft soap. Number three, pine oil. The formula is, actually it is not formula, it is ratio. The ratio is 1 is 10 is 20. That means, 1 part of oleic acid, 10 parts of soft soap and 20 parts of pine oil. Oleic acid is liquid, so we will take in ml. Soft soap is semi-solid, so we will take in grams. And pine oil is liquid, so we will take in ml. Today, I am going to prepare phenyl compound for 500 ml. I mean, my batch size is 500 ml. So, for 500 ml phenyl compound, I need to take 16 ml oleic acid, 160 grams soft soap and 320 ml pine oil. With 500 ml of phenyl compound, I can prepare 10 liters of white phenyl or scented phenyl. 10 liters white phenyl or colored phenyl is more than sufficient for our home for more than 2 months or at least 1 month. Now let us start the process. I have taken all the raw materials as per the ratio. The quality of raw materials are very important to prepare good quality of phenyl compound. This is 320 ml pine oil. It is clear and transparent. It is soft soap 160 grams. It is 16 ml of oleic acid. It is also clear and transparent. First, I am adding soft soap. And then I am adding oleic acid. And I am mixing thoroughly and making it as homogeneous paste. The paste will quickly form. It is not complicated. Here, one important safety thing we need to discuss. My batch size is just 500 ml. So, just by using the spoon, I am making the agitation process. Without touching the materials, I have completed the mixing process. In case of larger batch sizes, we need to use goggles and hand gloves. After the formation of paste, I am slowly, gradually adding the pine oil with constant stirring. Now the process is over. We need to keep settling for at least 24 hours. After that only we can use it. This is after 24 hours. Our phenyl compound or phenyl concentrate is ready. We will compare it with branded phenyl compound purchased from supermarket. I will transfer it to the beakers so that we can see its clarity, quality and consistency. This is our phenyl compound light yellow or golden color. This is branded phenyl compound. It is golden brown color. By diluting this phenyl compound in water, we can prepare white phenyl. Now we can prepare white phenyl from both from our phenyl compound as well as branded phenyl compound. In this third beaker, I am taking our phenyl compound. This is for the purpose of preparing thick white phenyl. I mean, I am going to add thickening gel in this phenyl compound. Water plus thickening gel. 
in all these three beakers i have taken 50 ml of phenyl compound or phenyl concentrate so i am going to mix with 950 ml of water 1 is to 19 so i can prepare 1 liter of white phenyl first let us start with branded phenyl compound i am adding 50 ml phenyl compound and i am gradually adding 950 ml of ro water and continuously stirring now white phenyl is ready second i am adding our phenyl compound and making white phenyl stirring for few minutes now phenyl compound is ready next we will prepare thick white phenyl this is thickening gel this is carbopolymer gel how to prepare carbopolymer gel that video i have given the link in description now i am adding 50 ml phenyl compound carbopolymer gel and gradually adding 900 ml of water because i have taken 50 ml of gel approximately now thick white phenyl also ready now we will transfer all these three phenyls to the beaker so that we can see the clarity and consistency this is the white phenyl prepared from branded phenyl concentrate this is white phenyl prepared from our phenyl concentrate this is thick white phenyl prepared from our phenyl compound more or less all these three phenyls are looks like same our phenyl is little brighter little whiter in color now we will see we will check how the phenyl flow over the surface with the proper packing and labeling you can sell it commercially before that one more important thing we need to carry out we should ensure that there is no layer separation for at least 6 months but within 24 hours we can get some idea whether is there any layer separation tomorrow we will see all these three bottles there is no yellow color or brown color ring formation at the top of the phenyl solution if any thin ring or thin layer of ring we have seen then after one month or after three months or after six months it will become a very thick layer there is possibility for layer separation there is no thin ring in any of these three bottles this is one thing and another thing we should check is there any partitions or portions separation in vertical so all these three bottles are homogeneous no ring formation within 24 hours just will get an idea only but this is not ultimate confirmation for any product for any new formula we should keep it stability study for at least 6 months that is the ultimate confirmation thank you friends thank you for watching this video your suggestions and feedbacks are always welcome we'll meet in our upcoming videos